I run because it's one of the easiest things a human can do, yet it's the hardest thing that you can do. And I actually hated running when I was a kid and then started running seriously probably about four years ago and just got hooked. The, the passion kicked in just before I had my accident. It woke me up a little bit. It made me appreciate a lot more in life. I've always been a 120% kind of guy, so after having that accident, it just kind of caught a bit of a wake-up call and started to enjoy things and to kind of be more present. Rejuvenate stands for to start anew or to start afresh. I'm giving people a fresh start at life, giving them you know, opportunities to, to get up and get going again. I decided that I was gonna run for Joy and we're gonna raise money to buy her a new wheelchair. I've known Joy pretty much my whole life. My gran adopted her, she's got brittle bone disease and she's wheelchair bound. So I just thought, you know, it would be really cool to kick off the foundation Rejuvenate South Africa with me running one of the craziest races in South Africa for someone that I know and helping them out. There is a massive problem in South Africa. It's just so expensive. The government funding isn't there. Medical aid funding is pretty much non-existent. No one gets the luxury of a, of a prosthetic limb in this country. Very few people think they can run again yeah. after they've had an accident. That's why we've been doing the mobility clinics. And a lot of them haven't even run for 10 years since they've had their accident. And then they get on a blade and you just see how their faces light up and how they, their confidence grow. You know, life is quite unfair when you're stuck because your body doesn't allow you to. And there are the tools out there that allow us to, to change this. So I don't see why it shouldn't be a right to move. Everyone should have the right to be able to be mobile. I never ever in my life thought my path would lead me to where I am today. And being an amputee doesn't mean you have to stop living. We can do anything that we, that we put our mind to.